We are in 2032 and this is what we see. Regarding hygiene infrastructure in Cambodia, we see that clean water is accessible to everyone. Sustainable wastewater management systems are installed in every building, city, province. Waste management and sanitation landfill are set up properly in every province. Hygienic toilet systems are being used in every household. We are in 2032, and we see that women and men know more about sexual and reproductive health knowledge. They open their minds to talk, discuss their sexual and reproductive health. School is a good place for young teenagers to learn the basic knowledge about it, and simple yet powerful courses are taught. We are in 2032. We see the enhancement of life quality through access to products with better nutrition value. Nutrition food knowledge is provided to everyone at school and everyone value more seasonal and plant-based food. We are in 2032. In Cambodia, there are communities centered in every province. For all Cambodians to access psychologists and psychiatric to those seeking mental health support. The resources are created and supported by the local leaders and healthcare specialists. All the schools in Cambodia integrate hygiene practice and hygiene education as the fundamental from kindergarten onward. People who live near the river or the canal don't throw their waste into it anymore. The canals in Phnom Penh have become a beautiful and smell-free picnic area with flowers everywhere. People can swim peacefully in the transparent water. It has become a tourist attraction and a role model city for the world. We are in 2032 and we can see that all patients receive equal access to healthcare provided by the trusted healthcare system and ethical healthcare providers. We are in 2032. We see a great affordable healthcare system in remote areas via telemedicine and improved capacity building by bringing all healthcare workforce volunteers to the villages quarterly.